Yes, my dear friend, welcome back to the channel. It is a beautiful afternoon here in Southeast Asia, Malaysia, to be precise. Wherever you are on the globe, especially on the continent of Africa, in Europe, in America, Canada, or even right here with me, Southeast Asia. Dear friend, you are welcome to this very special afternoon edition. Yes, afternoon edi edition here on Salem's blog. I am back with more exclusives. Right now, we are starting with the Euros. Then we conclude with Chelsea. Then we go to some other items on our menu this afternoon it is a very hot menu for you this afternoon whatever you are doing enjoy it to the end dear friend remember i will be giving you a shout out at the end of the video so don't go anywhere your name might just come up in the shout out section dear friend all right quickly let's start with kelly mbappe kelly mbappe yesterday the game that was played between france and spain france are through to the finals of the euro 2024 yes 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 you know, uh, sorry, Spain are true. Spain are true. I'm sorry about that. Spain are true to the finals. France will have to settle for the third or fourth position. Yes, my dear friend. So, Kylian Mbappe is speaking to the press after the game. This is what he had to say. He said, in football, you are good or not good. I wasn't good. Admission. He admitted that in this Euro... He wasn't good enough. Dear friend, Kelly Mbappe says that he wasn't good enough in this Euro. He said, my Euro was a failure. Mm. I wanted to be European champion. I will now go on a holiday. I will reset well. It will do me a lot of good. Then I will get ready to start a new life. There is a lot to do. I will get ready to start a new life. Where? New life with Real Madrid. Real Madrid. Dear friend, that is Kelly Mbappe speaking after the game last night against Spain. All right. Okay. Breaking news. Julian Alvarez is open to a move from Man City. Julian Alvarez, yeah, the striker at Man City. I spoke about him a few weeks ago. I dedicated a whole week talking about Julian Alvarez to Chelsea. Well, whether Manchester City are ready to sell or not, the player is ready, according to the Athletic FC. The player is ready to move away from Manchester City for a first team football. He's tired of, of sitting on a bench, just like Kopama. Yes, Kopama was tired of sitting on a bench and he moved to Chelsea and now he's a mainstay in that Chelsea setup. And as a matter of fact, he's always the number one to be mentioned when he talks to, when he talks about Chelsea last season. Julian Alvarez with Chelsea. Is it gonna be a deal? Deal or no deal? Let me hear from you in the comment section. We know him. He was I mean, he is a very good striker. He is good. He is just good. But the point is, when you are in Man City, there are so many talents. There are people who are ahead of in the, you, know, you know, in the pecking. But maybe, maybe, maybe he might just come to Chelsea and explode, explode just as we are seeing Kopama exploding at Chelsea right now, dear friend. Just as we are seeing Kopama exploding at Chelsea. He might also come to Chelsea and explode the same way. Well, we'll talk about Julian Alvarez in the coming days. We'll continue to monitor the situation and then we'll talk about that in the coming days. As Chelsea are still in the market for a striker. But we understand our coach Enzo Maresca really want to try the players that are available. Nicolas Jackson, Christopher Nkuku and Magwe. This three, yes, in this preseason training from now, he wants to work with them for a while and see their sharpness, their fitness level. Then the final decision we made whether they will still have to go in for a striker or not. That is Chelsea's position right now. All right, just look at this picture on your screen. This is not Europe, this is not Argentina, this is the USA where football is called soccer. This is USA where football is called soccer. Lionel Messi's influence is unreal. Over 80,000 capacity filled to the brim to watch Argentina Canada match. Argentina, Canada. Argentina are true also from there. Canada are out. Argentina, hopefully. And maybe, are we going to be seeing Spain carrying the Euro 2024 and Argentina carrying the uh, Copa America? Well, 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 well. It's very, very likely. The way things are going, it's very, very likely. Wait. Before I go, before I move on, England tonight. England against Netherlands tonight. England, Netherlands tonight. Wait for it. Uh, finally, I am going to receive England. Football is coming home. Football is coming home. Are we going to see England sing the song, Football is coming home? Really, is football coming, coming home? 
is a trophy coming to England. I heard in some quarters, dear friend, that if Gary Southgate should get to the final, he will be knighted with the title Sir. Are we going to be hearing Sir Gareth Southgate very soon? You know, it's a British title, right? Yeah. He will be knighted with the Sir title. He will be knighted. Sir Gareth Southgate. Wow, wow. That is to Southgate fans. All right. Before we go to some other news quickly, Enzo Fernandez was deployed as a deep line playmaker in the Copa America semi final against Canada with impressive statistics. One assist, one big chance created, 55 out of 59 passes completed. Best position for him. Right now, he's still at the Copa America, not in preseason yet. Should we deploy him just as he was deployed last night against the Canadians? Deep line playmaker. If you watch the video, well, let me see you. As you can see the video right there, a few seconds video. Deep line playmaker. Should Chelsea deploy him the same way? Well, I would say so. If we should. If, if, if that's what will work out. So that uh, Casado will come forward a little. Casado can just be ahead of him. Maybe partnering with uh, uh, Dewsbury. Well, we wait to see. Yeah, we wait to see. But he did yesterday. He gave one assist, one big chance, chance created, and fifty-five out of fifty-nine passes completed. Well, 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 well. You, you saw him with uh, how do you call him? Lionel Messi celebrating after they go. Yeah, after they go, dear friend. All right then. Like I said, tonight is Netherlands England Euro twenty twenty four. All right. Renato Viegas final part of medical will be done today. Yes, Renato Viegas' final part of medical, the defender we just signed. The last part of his medical will be done today, Wednesday. Then document will be signed between Chelsea and FC Basel. Officially, everything should be done and complete today. Then we can now hear the official, official unveiling of Renato Viegas you know, to Chelsea from FC Basel. Yeah, everything could be done today. The medical will be done today, document will be signed. Then after, the former announcement of the player. Dear friend. All right, some pictures rolling on your screen right now. Pictures from yesterday, day two of our training, preseason training. Day two. You can see Angelo, Noni, Madweke, and Kanichuku Emeka on your screen right there. That is day two of our preseason training at Cobham. Day two. And here, day two, you see Romeo Lavia, Raheem Sterling. Yeah, 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 yeah. This was posted by Romeo Lavia, actually. Yes. You see him right there and Raheem Sterling also in your view. All right, to some other news. It is a very big afternoon, great afternoon, hot afternoon. Depends on where you are. So let me not waste much of your time. Let me not waste much of time, your time. Quickly, in some other news, Jao Palina has already completed his medical as new Bayern player. Contract until June 2028 to be signed today in Munich. Fuha will receive a fee in the region of 50 million euros plus add-ons. Here we go. Confirm. Here we go. Dear friend, it is here we go. Jao Palina to buy a minute. Deal completed. Okay. Yes, I nearly forgot this. Look at this picture. Credit to Moy Drink for coming back as soon as possible. Plenty of players who wouldn't do that. A lot of players out there might wouldn't do that. But Moy Drink, as soon as his hero is over, he didn't go for holidays. Straight away to London and he is part of the squad currently at Cobham. Working with the new coach Mareska, you can see him right there with the coach standing and talking. I'm not sure what the coach is telling him, but hopefully, hopefully, Modric this season will be his season in Chelsea. Yes, hopefully, Modric should celebrate this season well under Mareska, Enzo Mareska, dear friend. All right, Manchester United former bid worth over 50 million euro for Lenny Euro. Lenny Euro has been accepted by Lily today. Lily insisted, or Lily insisting with Euro to accept Man United as its best proposal on their table. Lenny Euro has always given a priority to Real Madrid, waiting for their decision up to Euro at this moment. Lily has accepted the offer from, from Manchester United, but the player wants to go to Bayern. <coughs> I'm sorry. The player wants to go to Real Madrid. <coughs> Yes, it's one of those things. Please, I need water. 
The player wants to go to Real Madrid. Thank you. Pardon me. Yeah. The player wants to go to Real Madrid. Yes. He wants to go to Real Madrid. But the offer from Real Madrid is just not enough. It's just not enough for Lily. Manchester United presented, presented a better offer in the region of 50 million, 50 million euro. And that was accepted by Lily. But the player's choice is Real Madrid. Now, it is his decision to make. It is a player's decision to make. Dear friend, all right, on that note, quickly, before I let you go, on that note, let me give some few shout outs. Few shout outs. Abdul Latif from Kenya, very big shout out to you. Abdul Latif from Kenya, very big shout out to you. Okita Samuel, Lagos State, Nigeria, very big shout out to you this afternoon. Yes, 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 very big shout out to you, very this afternoon. Kole Wisdom. Kole Wisdom from GH Ghana. Kole Wisdom from GH Ghana. Very big shout out to you. Jonathan, Uganda. Very big shout out to you, my number one fan. Jonathan from Uganda. Number one fan out there. Yes, I love you so much, brother. Yes. Kenneth Ndokum. Ndokum, Biasla State, Nigeria. Izu, Izudon Steven. Yes, Izudon Steven, Nigeria. Uh, Again, Ajabi Lawson, Cameroon. Ajabi Lawson, Cameroon. Very big shout out to you, all of you guys out there. Very big shout out to you all out there. Majesty Ghana. Very big shout out to you. Joseph H. Smith. Joseph H. Smith from Liberia. Liberia. Very big shout out to you as well. Wherever you are right now, very great afternoon to you. Sodik Orifiswan, Nigeria. Very big shout out to you as well. Dear friends, keep your comments coming in with your names. The next shout out might be you. Don't go anywhere. I'll be back with more exclusives in the coming hours. I'll see you in the next one when you see me, dear friend. Shalom and peace.